Hello everyone. In the previous tutorial, I showed you how to use the jQuery hide and show functions. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the simple toggle functionality. So the toggle functionality will do the same thing as the hide and show functions, except it'll require a lot less code. So once you click on this toggle button, it will toggle the hide and show value of this div, of this block. So to perform this functionality, we just need a blank index.html file. Uh, we need a blank HTML structure. I'll call this page jQuery toggle. And we'll also need to link to the jQuery library. And I'll go ahead and get the library from jQuery.com. If you go there and click on the download button, you'll be taken to this page where you can link to the latest jQuery library. Okay, so we've added the jQuery library to our page, and inside our page we also want to have a button. We'll give it a class of toggle, and a value of, let's go with toggle me. And we'll also want to create a block that we can show and hide. <clears throat> and we'll want to give that block a little bit of style. We'll want to give the block a gray background, width of 300 pixels, and height of 150 pixels. And then we'll want to go ahead and add the JavaScript to this page. First I'll show you what the page looks like right now. Currently this is what our page looks like with no functionality, and that's what we're going to add now. So we'll need the basic jQuery document ready function, and inside this function we're going to tell the toggle button that once it is clicked to run this function. And inside this function we are going to tell the block to toggle. And that is it. <clears throat> this is the code that will uh, set the block to show and hide. And it's very simple. And if we refresh the page, you'll see if you click on the button, it will hide and show the block. This is just a basic beginner tutorial on jQuery. There are more advanced tutorials to come. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.